This is a demonstration of the EMX model CNTX-30-0 contrast sensor from EMX Industries. The sensor features a display of 0 to 50 which indicates the strength of the reflected signal from the target. So if I block the light with my hand, the uh, signal level goes, uh, goes down to 0. Uh, this, this is a unique application because we're setting up the sensor, the contrast sensor, at a relatively long distance, uh, 400 millimeters, to a uh, reflector. So right now we're getting a very strong reflected signal from the reflector, and that's registering on the sensor at a value of 50. And we set a threshold at a value of 40, and we're going to pass objects, various objects, in between the sensor and the uh, reflector and cause the sensor output to turn off. The sensor output NPN or PNP is connected to uh, an LED on this little demo box. So as the LED turns on and off, that indicates the, uh, that the sensor is recognizing the presence of the object and that output would typically be connected to a, uh, to a PLC. So this is an opaque object, blocks all the light, the sensor reads zero, the output turns off. Here's another opaque object, a coffee cup. Again, blocks all the light, output turns off. Here is a, a tinted object, a soda container. You can see the reading goes very low, 0, 04, well below the threshold of 40. Again, the output turns off. Here is a, a preform. So you can see as we pass the preform through the light, the signal level goes way down and the output turns off again. Here is another preform which is uh, a little bit more transparent. Again the reading goes very low, output turns off. Here is a uh, glass and we can see that the light passes through the glass, comes back to the uh, sensor and again registers very low, the output turns off. And finally we have a container uh, and we're measuring through the area where there is no liquid. So it's a glass container. Uh, we're in the area where there's no liquid. And we're getting a higher reading than on the other samples, but still well below the value of 40, which is where the threshold is set, and the output is turned off. So the sensor has a response time of uh, about 100 microseconds. So it's able to measure and output a signal uh, very fast. If we look at, here's a glass glass rod, I'm going to pass the glass rod between the sensor and the reflector. So we can see the signal drops below, below the threshold and turns off. And the glass rod is approximately uh, four or five millimeters in diameter. And the output's very fast. Even though you don't see the display changing here, you can see the output is turning on and off as I pass the uh, glass rod between the uh, transmitter and the uh, reflector. So that's a CNTX and that is an application uh, to detect <coughs> objects moving on a conveyor uh, including clear or transparent objects.